Someone once asked me, why do you exaggerate the virtues of Ali? So I thought to myself, is it possible to overstate the merits of this man? You can't speak about someone unless you know them. And no one knew Ali like Muhammad So what did the Holy Prophet say about the virtues of Ali? After all, the Holy Prophet's words are divinely inspired as the Holy Quran says, in Surah An-Najm, Surah number 53, verses 3 and 4, وَمَا يَنْطِقُ عَنِ الْهَوَىٰ إِنْ هُوَ إِلَّا وَحْيٌ يُوحَىٰ He does not speak of his own accord. What he speaks is inspired revelation. So when Muhammad speaks about Ali, it's actually God himself who is speaking about Ali. So what did the Holy Prophet say about the virtues of Ali? It is recorded that Khawarizmi, the prominent Sunni scholar in his book Manaqib, he says that the Holy Prophet one day said to Amir al-Mu'mineen, Ya Ali, لَوْلَا أَنِّي أَخَافُ أَنْ يَقُولَ فِيكْ مَا قَالَتِ النَّصَارَى فِي الْمَسِيحِ لَقُلْتُ الْيَوْمَ فِيكَ مَقَالَةً لَا تَمُرُّ بِمَلَئٍ مِّنَ الْمُسْلِمِينَ إِلَّا أَخَذِ التُّرَابَ مِنْ قَدَمِكَ أو علي if it were not for the fear that I have, that Muslims will say about you what the Christians said about Jesus, I would speak about you in such a way that whenever you pass by, whenever you walk by a group of people, they will take the dust from your feet to seek blessings. Brothers and sisters, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has filled the universe with wondrous signs. He created the luminous sun the dazzling stars and the majestic mountains. But sometimes Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wants to show us His beauty and His power and His wisdom. And sometimes He wants to show us His illustrious signs in people. So He creates someone like Ali ibn Abi Talib. My dear brothers and sisters, we ask Allah Azza wa Jal to raise us on the Day of Judgment with Ali ibn Abi Talib. And why is Ali so dear to us? because he was the closest one to the Holy Prophet. He was the gate to the city of knowledge. He was the husband to the daughter of the Prophet. And he was the one who defended the Prophet when all others ran away. We ask Allah Azza wa Jal to raise us with Ali ibn Abi Talib on the Day of Judgment. And we ask Allah Azza wa Jal to give us the tawfiq to be buried in the holy city of Najaf besides the commander of the faithful, Ali ibn Abi Talib salawatullahi alayhi. We ask Allah Azza wa to illuminate our hearts with the light of Ali wa sallallahu ala sayyidina wa nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala ahli baytihi al-tayyibin al-tahirin